Okay, so I'm gonna talk about greenwashing today and first of all, how annoying it is. But since I started going low tox, non tox, I wish I could be fully non toxic, but our, our uh, environment in this world is not non tox. Anyways, um, a lot of people that I help, their first thing they want to do it too, and they go to companies like Seventh Generation, um, Mrs. Myers, things like that. They're not clean. They are not clean. So my first thing would say be get the EWG app. It is fantastic. It is way better than the other apps out there. Now here, this is a company I'm talking about right here, Mrs. Myers. Not clean. And if you go to the EWG app, most of the readings are D's. The highest is a B, but they do not have a good rating. Then you have Native, which they generally score three to four on EWG. They got fragrances and stuff like that. It's just, they have way more things than just fragrance, but again, another company, greenwashing. Seven Generation have some A's, mostly C's and D's on the EWG app. Again, just why? Like, why do we have to look how clean this looks, right? Doesn't this look like a clean label? Like, oh, this would be good for me? Newsflash, it's not. And then you have Burt's Bees that sold out, and they have a couple with better ratings, but most of them are in the four to fives. I'm not putting anything on my skin with a four to five rating. And it just sucks because a once clean brand is now not. But we're still using the same marketing that it's clean. Like, really? And it really sucks that in this day and age, we have to worry so much about what we're putting on our skin because there's zero regulations for these companies. But again, if we use healthy products, clean products, then we will be healthier. And we know that here in this American country that that is not what they want. However, there are some actually clean brands out there and I should do a video on that. So let me know if you wanna see that.